At the yards, Ari and Bert were with Neville, the new engine. Neville was a steamy, but he had a square body like a diesel. Neville was backing up towards some trucks. Then there was trouble. Neville looked sad. <laughs> <laughs> laughing with Neville. It was Neville pulling Annie and Clarabelle. Hello, puffed Neville cheerfully. Neville didn't know what he had done. Hello, said Neville happily. I know you're going to biff into all the steamy. And Neville puffed sadly away. Neville was speeding through the countryside as fast as he could. Suddenly, Neville saw a barrier on the track. He slammed on his brakes, but it was too late. Neville was in terrible trouble. He was on the broken end of the bridge. Clarabelle and was coupled up. Slowly and steadily, he began to pull Neville back from the edge. The bridge made a creaking noise. With one big puff, he pulled Neville's wheels off the bridge. Thomas had done it. He had saved Neville and Annie and Clarabelle. Thank you, whistled Neville. Neville was very happy. At last, he knew he had a good friend in Thomas. Up the line, Emily and Whiff passed more engines. When they saw Whiff, they all laughed too. Then, Neville arrived to collect some freight cars. He was excited. The brass band is arriving at Brendam Docks. So do I, but I'm never asked to pull them. If you go to the washdown now, you'll sweep. But it was too late. 